Despite being one of the greatest boxers to ever live, Evander Holyfield is overlooked and underrated. Evander Holyfield was a no-nonsense, hard-fighting boxer puncher. There wasn't a lot of public drama with Evander Holyfield, and in comparison to his nearest heavyweight rival, the loud-mouthed, flashy Mike Tyson, for many, Holyfield appeared to be boring. Maybe it's what contributed to him being underrated today. But it was only after Holyfield's defeats of Tyson that he started to get his due. He wasn't a flashy technical fighter or necessarily a big puncher, but he was all around technically sound. Holyfield didn't have many weak spots, except for his lack of size compared to the big heavyweights. But it didn't matter. He fought all the best of his era, engaging in epic battles with the likes of Riddick Bow, Buster Douglas, Larry Holmes, George Foreman, Lennox Lewis, and of course, Mike Tyson. Holyfield would fight until he was 48 years old. While the names on his resume are impressive, his accolades are even more so. Nicknamed the real deal, Holyfield is the only four-time world champion and the only boxer in history to win the undisputed championship in two weight classes. I mean, that speaks for itself. It's too bad he is underrated because what Evander Holyfield really is was one of the most overachieving and impressive heavyweights and boxing champions in history.